This video is going to be about how to boost FPS and performance and fix FPS drops using the Razer Cortex FPS Booster tool on any low-end PC and laptops. So, if you're new here hit that subscribe button for more content. Let's dive into the video. First go to my Discord server. Click on the download link. Now click on the subscribe to unlock button. Now subscribe my channel to unlock the link. Now as you can see, the link is unlocking and download the pack and follow me. For settings, here you will go discount of the interface for the weather cortex on today's unit. Simply check mark onto the weather cortex. Listen behind. Check all of these boxes. Now here you can find out. This is a 170 megabyte download. Click on this install button and it will start downloading the Razer cortex on your computer. So guys, once the downloading and installation process is completed in your Razer Cortex, now it's time to launching the software and using the path settings for boosting your old PC performance. So guys, check mark onto the launch Razer Cortex and click on the get started button. So once you have installed the River Cortex on your computer, so you will go to this kind of the interface. Let me show you all of this single game, which is installed on your computer. So guys, now settings, which you need to do on your computer for optimizing it. You need to guys follow properly also on your computer. So guys, first go of all, straight towards this game booster section, and here you will find out. There's a lot of option and you can find out here. This enable CPU cord, disable CPU silly mode, enable game power solution. Clear clipboard here is a lot of services will be disabled while you're playing the game. There is another server, which is the expert or X file. Also jack mark here click OK. Launch game on game desktop also jack mark click OK. And guys these settings you need to do before. Playing this game on your computer. Once you guys done a with special section of the rhythm chord. Now you need to scroll all the way down. And here is the processor, which is running in my background right now. So, what you need to do is you select out guy. every single unused program from your computer. Like for example, right now I'm using the obvious studio. Island Lord checkmark. On this application, there is the score. I'm not using it in my bag while I'm playing. So I will check mark here. Also check mark for the Skype. There is a search post or X just simply leave it. Here is a Microsoft Edge Blacktail. There is the EMP if you have knowledge what what is this aggregation about so guys. Simply check mark and if you don't know like what this application does on your computer. So guys don't uncheck or don't check mark onto that box here. The end video share. Also uncheck this box. Don't check it. Here is the Epic app. Here is a Cortana. Check mark here and video container. Just simply leave it. Here is the live wallpaper. Also check mark here. Here is the Next option, which was for window. And here is most important guide option, which you need to check mark for. Disabling option while you playing the game to the runtime broker. Simple check mark here. Now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find out more options like here. To also check mark here guys. Once you're done with all of the settings, now you need to scroll more down and here you will go. Services tab. And here is all of the Windows services which are running in your bag and while you're playing game so guys Once you're done with all of the settings Now simply you need to click on this push now button You can also guys Click on this recommend settings But we have done already all the settings So therefore Simply click on this boost now button And this will stop all of the bag reputation from running in your bag And while you are playing games You guys want to do all of the settings guys Now let's go For one next step That is the system booster Option and guys You will find out Lot of option Like the application junk The game junk file there is just free system junk file, recycling, and a lot of guys, other stuff. So guys, if you click on this which first is file, the system cleanup, click it on this button, and guys it will enable the settings, and now click on the scan now button, and we'll start scanning all of the system junk file from your computer, or simply click on the screen button, and that will guys clean all of the junk file from your computer. So guys, simply the click the screen on button, and it will start deleting all of the and is used for temporary data from your computer. So here we have saved 22 gigabytes from my computer. So now let's go for the next step, which is the speed up tab. And guys here, you will find out this, this cache cleanup and the Dexter manualization. And guys, you no need to change anything from here. Just simply click on this optimized button and that will start optimizing all of your PC for the best performance. So guys, you're done with all of your settings. Now guys, let's UH try this option. So first of all, let's go into our first option, which is a uh, the game booster. Simply click here on the booster option. And guys here to start. Disabling all of these guys. Application from my bag. And you can check it out here. The relief memory, which is my RAM. That is around to GP of the RAM. These guys cleaned from my computer by using this option. And you can check it out here. This all the program which was running before. Now these are disabled. And these are not working in my computer. So let's go for the task manager of my Windows. And here you can check it out here. The CP usage, a lot less than before. Here is my memory usage, guys. Now let's go for the next option, which is the assistant booster. Go for the speed up tab and click here on this optimize button. And again, optimizing your 
all of these application and program or your hard disk core every single component so guys once you're done with all of these settings now you need to simply launch your game so how do you guys launch your game you need to go for this launcher tab and here you will find that is fortnite or whatever game. to launch click it on display button and here you will go to this kind of guys settings or interface click on the start game button and that you guys launch the fortnite on your computer with the best performance out of your every single component of your PC so. Guys that's it for this video and I hope that you love it. So please make sure to subscribe, turn on the bell, notification, and drop a like on this video and also share your opinion about the next topic which you need on my channel. So guys let the next video peace out.